What's your name? What's your name? My name is Adetunji. Mr. Adetunji, with the current situation of Nigeria, most especially with the NSAS protest, do you think Nigerian youth now have a voice? Do you think we are being heard? Do you think in the next coming election, Nigerian youth will have a seat in the government house? Um, to your question, I don't think so. Why I say I don't think so that the voice of the youth are not being heard is because the way things were right from the past, there is no any sign to show that their voice are being heard. If not, what really happened at that show gate? It's really, really uncalled for. We are humans. We are not animals. There are ways to tackle such issues. They should have just go there and just carry them away with tear gas. That was instead of them opening fire on them. They are humans. And, and as well, they are fighting for their rights. Am I communicating? I'm a youth as well. I supposed to be there. But I knew what will happen. I knew, I'm telling you the truth, I knew what will happen, that Nigeria is not a place whereby they will hear you in a soft way. They are making a peaceful protest. They only have flags in their hands, no weapons in their hands, and they are opening fire on them, for Christ's sake. It's not done anywhere, I'm telling you the truth. Protests have been happening all over the world. When you are having that flag with you, it shows a sign of peace. A sign of peace. So I don't really know why they are doing them like that. So we need justice. We need justice. Before our voice can be heard in this country, I'm telling you the truth. What we need to do that the international bodies has to come in. The international body has to come. But if we should leave it with them, with our leaders in Nigeria, they are just doing rubbish. I'm telling you the truth. They are just doing rubbish. Let me tell you the truth. What they are doing in Nigeria, they are doing the kind of a scenario of what we call we we. We we is that they all know themselves. They are all the same. There's nothing like PDP or APC. It's a lie. They are all one. I'm telling you the truth. But the justice, everybody, they are the same. They are the same. But if you are not part of them, I'm telling you, you are going to have a problem. But if you are part of them, you don't have any problem. So that's what that is. Mr. Luchiji, if you were to be the president at that point of the NSAS protest, what would you have done differently? If I had been the president, what I would have done is this. I'm going to call on uh, a body to come in that they should, they should immediately sit and to see how they can talk to these people in peace. Such thing they call it emergency. They call it urgent. Need that need to be attended to immediately. You have to stop everything that you are doing and to say a word of peace to them. That okay, this is what you people want. Please give us so 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 time for us to do all these things for you. Even after they cannot meet up with all the requests that they made. But people would have seen the sign that things are being done. You understand? It's not it's not a thing that you just say, we will do it, we will do it, we will do it. Nigeria is a place that we just talk and talk and talk and talk. We don't have action. But they have action now to kill people. But they don't have action to take the right thing to be done. So that is my own view with all these things that is happening, I'm telling you.